The stage is set, and the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? It's live next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Brazil up against Portugal. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Lucas Paqueta starts with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the striker is Richarlison. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And it's an interesting-looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. And this confrontation is underway. Joao Felix. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. An incisive pass. Vinicius Jr. Casimiro, and he takes on the shot. Well, tremendous block. Read it superbly to take back possession. Bishamas on, and a decent save. Full credit. short corner Paqueta it should be a oh, tremendous block Neymar fantastic work to thwart the danger well it's been a long and winding road to the final for Portugal it's worth remembering that they finished second in the qualifying group they had to go through playoff matches against Turkey and North Macedonia just to get to the 2022 finals. And this past month has been challenging as well, but they're here and they have a well-earned track record as winners. Well, you're absolutely right, but I think they've got better and better as the tournament has worn on. They've got a great understanding of what's required of each player on the pitch. They're good tactically, they've been fit, and I think they've got every chance of being the world champions here, but they're gonna have to play well. Well, who would be a defender 
when the responsibility is one of trying to shackle Neymar. Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. And threading it forward. Disappointing pass. A oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. And getting across to stop it. A short corner another corner conceded what can they do with this one <laughs> corner kick played in well the keeper had to intervene under a bit of pressure there Ruben Neves. Now with Silva. Joao Felix. An alert intervention. Might really be able to trouble them here. Paqueta. Oh, what an opportunity. And how about that for a save? Well, we could have made that decision from up here on the commentary box. Ramos. And can they create something? Oh, there's the goal! There's the opener! How about that? Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. And Brazil get the ball rolling once more. How will they react to the setback? Dallo. On to Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes! Oh, not to be. That would have put them well on their way, Stuart. Well, that could prove to be a big miss. Surely has to score there. Great pressure to win the ball back. And giving the ball away. And still a chance. And thumped away. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Now he must favour the cross. Aware of a threat, solving the problem. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Felix. Takes the shot. A wonderful counter-attacking football. Just unfortunate that they didn't score. Well, had he scored, that would have been a great goal. The speed in which they changed from defence to attack was brilliant.
And a tidy tackle. Oh, lovely incisive pass. He scored once already and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. Who can they pick out? Well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. And Brazil in a position of menace. And he cuts inside. Richard is on. And a fine stop. And short it is. And a timely intervention. So a throw in here. Neymar. Vinicius Jr. Intercepting it intelligently. Richarlison. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. And now to level the game. And the spot kick is converted as coolly as you like. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser, 1-1. Gonzalo Ramos. Ruben Neves. Well, this is such a good watch. Both teams have played their part in a great game with plenty of good forward play. I'm sure we'll see more goals before the end. Yes, I mean, they're matching each other, attacking blow for attacking blow. That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. And over it comes. Body on the line. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. This again, the goal that was scored from the spot. Now, what's the keeper playing at? Great defending here. Throw in for Portugal coming up. Joao Felix. Can he put them in front? Fernandes, he's in here. And a good take under duress there. 
Paqueta. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Felix. Will he finish? And the keeper there to deal with it. Over it comes. Oh, it's a goal! And that gives them the advantage. Will they be able to keep it? Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. is here Casemiro Neymar Vinicius Junior splendid defending and it needed to be and with that the first half draws to a close So into the second half, can Brazil battle back after that first 45? Oh, good looking run. Well, the supporters think it's on. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. And taken short. Now sliding in field. Paqueta. Textbook defending inside the box. And Neymar. Now with Paqueta. Offside by a fraction. Diogo Dallo. Now potential danger. Real chance. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And it's a top class finish from Jao Felix. He just hits it with such power. That's a brilliant goal. Back underway at 3-1. Number 11, 
Joe Felix. Nicely timed tackle. Dallo. Oh, big opportunity. That is not going to do. Well wide of the target. of pass needs to be a bit better now can they counter clinically Rafinha well a classic example of how to intercept an example of how to press well it's been difficult for the Portuguese to get hold of the ball but their counter attacking has been really good particularly in the wide areas it's been an excellent performance from them so far. Yes, a really effective performance all in all. Joao Felix. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. That's useful play. Joao Felix. Brilliant save. Fancy a short one. And Bernardo Silva has it. What an important piece of defending. Another goal! And surely there's no way they can throw this away. Absolutely dominant. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So back in action. It's been all Portugal so far. You sense there could be extra punishment in store. They need to get tighter here. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Rafinha. Paqueta. Another perfect position to read it. Can they hit on the break? Neymar's there, others might join in. It should be. Reading it well. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. He's driven in the corner. Still not clear. Firing it in. Easy save. But well, he's got past his man. Can they convert? And danger still. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Cristiano Ronaldo. Could be a chance to break here. Well, it fizzled out. Well, very effective play in possession. That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. Both substitutes who've been getting ready will come on at the same time.
Who can he pick out? And the problem not completely solved. And Neymar. Now with Vinicius Jr. Casemiro. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Read it superbly to take back possession. And they might be onto something. It's still alive. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. And slot at home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Thiago Silva Vinicius Junior Ball with Danilo Eder Militao is with Vinicius Junior Good pressure to win the ball back Oh, a good diving save Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. They take it short. And Neymar! This looks promising. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. I think you've got to conclude that was good refereeing. A free kick in the end after initially playing advantage, but it just wasn't there. Otavio. He's got the right idea with that pass. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. Played over. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Well, he could give it away. Neymar. Alexandro. Not showing good defensive judgment. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. And the substitution will occur now. Vinicius Junior. Casimiro. And take it away. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rafael Leao and return to Ronaldo. Well, strong play here. Well, that's the end of that move for now. And the referee has decided to add on a minimum of five minutes.
Rafael Leao. Richarlison. Vinicius. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Pedro, and he takes it on, and the shot just over the top. Well, a big sigh of relief. That nearly proved costly. Well, he got away with that one, didn't he? It's a... And now it's all over. We've witnessed history. Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time. Well, they've been kings of Europe. Now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. Portugal, the world champions. And this is finally Portugal's time. Fully deserved. Best team in the world.